family friend got COVID-19 for two weeks in 2020. They were quarantined for 14 days. And then I realized how tough it is to have quarantine when you are sick. You cannot go outside to play, even for food. We were dropping out food at the front door. So the most exciting thing for me and my family friend in 2021 is COVID-19 vaccine and its treatment. Hello, my name is Tani Gupta, and in my speech today, I'm gonna cover the type of COVID-19 vaccines, approved COVID-19 vaccines in the United States, and how we can stop spreading COVID-19. These are the four main types of COVID-19 vaccines. Whole virus, protein subunit, nucleic acid, and viral vector. Whole virus. A vaccine uses whole virus to trigger the immune response. There are two main approaches. The first, is to use the weakened form of the virus so it can still reproduce without causing illness. The second is to use the genetic material that has been destroyed so it can not reproduce but it can still generate the immune response. These vaccines can cause the disease in people with weak immune systems. Protein subunit. A subunit vaccine uses pieces of pathognum fragments of protein to trigger the immune response. These vaccines have less side effects, but it can still weaken your immune system. Nucleic acid. A nucleic acid vaccine uses genetic material that is either RNA or DNA. It uses our cell's protein factories to trigger the immune response. In case of COVID-19, it's viral spike protein. The spike protein is found on the surface of the virus that causes COVID-19. These vaccines are easy to make and cheap. These vaccines need to be kept at negative 70 Celsius and lower. That must be really cold. Pfizer and Moderna's COVID-19 vaccines are using this approach. And these vaccines are the two FDA approved COVID-19 vaccines in the United States until now. Viral vector. A viral vector vaccine gives cells genetic instructions to produce the antigens. The viral vector vaccine copies a natural viral infection and should trigger a strong immune response. These vaccines have less effects for the virus mutations. How we can stop spreading COVID-19. We can stop spreading COVID-19 by wearing our mask, washing our hands, and staying six feet away from people. If we wear a mask and we have the virus, the virus won't spread. And if we wash our hands, we can all stay clean. While going outdoors, if we stay six feet away from people, we can all stay safe. So the most exciting thing for me in 2021 is COVID-19 vaccine and its treatment. We are all going through a very tough time and we can win this battle from this pandemic if we all follow the CDC guidelines. Thank you for watching.